Inspired by the Native American culture, their legends, and above all the beauty and vivid unfathomable power of the Indian music, the project Flute from Paradise has been born, whose spiritual creator, Pajuli, will give you a little insight into his work now. When I was 13 years old, I had a great experience which impressed me strong and changed my life. I began to think about it, sometimes to go just that way, which is the art. I began in my school time, and together with some friends, I developed further in the creation of traditional native South American music in search of our South American roots in art. In time, I decided to a more serious project, so I worked together with the theater group La Gran Marcha. With them, I picked up many new experiences and knowledge which is reflecting in my work nowadays. In the year 1992, with my travel to Europe, I made a very decisive step for my life. Here, I got to know many places, many people, and many new kinds of artistic ways of expression. During my travel through many states of Europe, such as France, Holland, Spain, Poland, I permanently was looking for any form, any color, any kind of any way I wanted to follow. After so much time of searching, the fate finally showed me the place, the studio, where I can realize all my ideas, my projects, my visions. After a long time of searching for a suitable studio, I truly found the recording studio Mountix in the town Königsbrück. Together with his good friend and brilliant sound engineer Mario Spinder, he could realize many of his visions. So in 2001, his first CD was created. One of the most important persons, of course, is Mario Spinder who knew to implement my ideas in a short time, and by his technical knowledge and dedication, I could finish two projects yet. Mario is the person who knows to build a bridge between my soul and this world. All my compositions and inspirations get their great and perfection they have just because of his work. About two years ago, Augusto came to me in my studio. He was looking for somebody who could technically convert his music project. Well, then we produced the first CD together, in which my work was mostly to improve the prefabricated arrangements and to change the sounds. The cooperation got more intensive, so we are working on our third project now. We use almost exclusively our own compositions, and so a relatively interesting mix is created between North and South American culture, connected with contemporary music, very much as pop music. At a short trip to America, I had the possibility to visit the USA and some of the states of Southern America, where I collected many elements, many experiences, the rhythms, the melodies, the instruments of the culture of our fathers. I used them as a principal base for rhythmical stresses to my work. The traditional inspiration in combination to modern elements are the key to success which we have in our performances and live concerts. At these performances, I have the luck that I can count on my friends who always walk along with me, such as Alex Gallegos, who I know since our childhood. Every time he supports me. There's also my friend Marco Canaliata, a very good critic to my work. And on the other side, he also gives me the feeling to be on the right way. Edward Soto, I've got to know him here in Germany at first, and who encourages me to my work with his advices and because of his great experience. 
not to forget Zagundo, Jose Luis, and my other friends who complete this work day after day. A very important part of this project occupies Veronica Sobel, who supports me very much in my work. With the special sound of her flute and with her ideas, she gives a lot of life and expression to the compositions as you can hear on our CDs. Well, since my childhood, music is a very important part of my life. I like to sing and to play instruments very much, especially the flute. In 1994, I got to know Augusto. We understand each other very good because we both make music. He told me about his ideas, his visions for the future. In 2001, he asked me if I wouldn't delight in making any recordings for a CD with him. Immediately, I was enthusiastic about this idea, this project. I enjoy very much the work for the CDs, especially the work for the own compositions, because Augusto gives me the possibility to integrate me and my own ideas. I'd like to thank all my friends, especially my guitarist Juan Bastidas, my pianist Ilya Yefimov, Marisol, for all her support, all my fans, my production team, Studio Mountings, and above all, my friend and spiritual brother Mario Spinter, and that you all believe in me, in my music, and for all your support. Thanks a lot. Fortunately, in our team we have a lot more projects and an exhausted surge of ideas, so I'm sure that we will be back soon with a new project. I hear the rhythm of your Indian drums. I hear the melodies of your flutes. I hear your voice in the wind.